Hey everybody, it's me Charata and welcome to my channel or welcome back if you're a returning subscriber. I'm so happy you decided to click on my video again. I'm super excited for this video because this is a holiday outfits video and instead of showing you multiple outfits, I had the idea where I would give you the formula for the outfit and then you can tweak it and create outfits on your own. So I have five outfit formulas for this video and I am super excited to talk about these outfits and show you guys everything that I style. Okay, so let's start with the first outfit. So first outfit is she's here to have a fun time. So the outfit formula for this outfit is a mini skirt and a top and patterned tights. I decided to wear my black mini skirt from Zara and a satin purple corset top that I've had for 12 years now. And for patterned tights, I went for my Gucci patterned tights. And I feel like the base outfit looked pretty good as it is. And to add the icing on the cake, I added these blue emerald statement earrings and I wanted to pull out the blue from the earrings so I decided to add a pop of color with the shoes. I went with my metallic blue Mew Mew shoes and, and I understand this look is not for everyone. These outfit formulas are for you if you're a extra girly and you just like to dress up. I completed the look with a neutral bag. I carried this black bag that had silver handles and yeah this is my first outfit formula you can definitely swap colors of the top and the skirt and the tights and this is a foolproof formula Formula number two is the diva. So the base outfit for this particular look is the metallic maxi dress. I actually wore this maxi dress for my birthday, I think two years ago. But we're all about reusing and re-wearing our outfits. So I decided to use that dress as a base layer for this outfit. And for the accessories, I went for vintage statement earrings. For the shoes, I decided to add my vintage Prada kitten heels. So they're statement heels and they add an interesting element to the base outfit. And to complete the look, I went for a statement coat, which is my vintage fur coat that I thrifted from Goodwill. For the final touch, I went for my burgundy clutch and I think this outfit looks super cool. You can definitely go for any of the maxi skirts that you have and use statement earrings, statement shoes and a statement coat. Make that dress party ready. So the outfit formula for this look is maxi dress, statement earrings, statement heels, statement coat and a clutch. Outfit 3 has to be my favorite and I am calling this Rockstar's Girlfriend and this outfit is so extra. So this outfit has a statement top, statement pants and statement jewelry and statement shoes that add a pop of color and a matching statement bag. So my base outfit here is a white beaded pearl statement top and a sequin black Band. so this forms my base outfit the next layer for this outfit is statement jewelry I decided to add a pearl choker and then a dainty little pearl choker to it and then I also added a metallic gold pendant necklace and I layered all these necklaces to create that statement look obviously this outfit needed a red lip so I went on and added a red lip to the outfit and then for the shoes, I went for these green heels. They are statement heels and they do add a pop of color to the outfit. I wore them for my graduation and these are my like fancy heels. 
and I also went with a magic green bag it's a sequin bag and I also wore this bag for my graduation so yeah this look is rock star's girlfriend and i am obsessed because literally it makes me feel like a disco ball what's not to love about this look is hostess with mostess and the outfit formula for this look is a cozy statement sweater a pair of comfortable statement pants statement shoes and a neutral bag so for this look i wore my vintage pearl cardigan honestly it might remind some people of a grandma cardigan but I love grandma fashion. So base outfit was this grandma sweater and these metallic pleated pants that I got a few years ago from the Zara Kids section. Then I added statement jewellery, the same choker from the last look and another necklace to layer it up. And for earrings, I layered my earrings, I added two different kinds of hoops and and I feel like jewelry makes the outfit go from bland to just like amazing and I absolutely love accessorizing and for the shoes I went for my metallic gold leather heels they are a statement shoe and since everything was statement I decided to go for a neutral bag which is my vintage coach monogram bag and this is the final outfit it's a super comfy look if you're hosting people and it also makes you feel like the diva that you are Calling the outfit formula number five she's classy and the outfit formula for this look is mini dress tights statement earrings statement coat statement shoes and a statement bag I love my statement pieces and I love pairing them together so for this look the base outfit was my mini dress it's a vintage silk mini dress that I wore to my graduation and I also added a pair of black tights. Honestly, I would have loved if the tights were more on the sheer side, but I gotta work with what I had. I added the same green heels from one of my previous looks to add a pop of color. And then I added a ribbon to my hair that I am still wearing right now. I am obsessed with bows as everyone else is. I'm not unique or iconic, but yeah, I feel like the top bun and the bow in the hair makes a hell lot of difference to the outfit. It literally pulls the outfit together in my opinion. And then the piece de resistance, my <laughs> black fur coat that I recently thrifted that I am so freaking obsessed with. It's a floor length black fur coat. Now that's iconic. <laughs> and for the bag, I went for my metallic coach pillow tabby because we're all about making a statement. And yeah, this is my final look. I absolutely love this. Most of the pieces in this look are vintage like the fur coat and the dress. And yeah, this is my final outfit. Those are all the outfit formulas that I had for you guys today. You can always like swap out colors or the kinds of dresses that I'm wearing but the outfit formula would actually 
stay the same and i feel like having these outfit formulas is really helpful when you're styling looks so i hope these really help you guys out when you're planning outfits for either christmas or new years or any of the other holiday events that you have going on these outfit formulas are for the extra girl obviously you can tone all of these things down but that is not the person i am that is why all of these outfits are like super extra but yeah that's it for this video let, let me know if you guys enjoyed this format the outfit formula kind of video i haven't really seen anybody do this on youtube they might have i've never seen a video like this so i'm like very proud of this concept and yeah if you guys enjoyed this video you know what to do give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you're not subscribed already and let me know in the comments below which is your favorite outfit formula or the favorite outfit that i styled i hope you guys have amazing holidays a merry christmas and a beautiful new year and i'll see you in my next video next monday until then bye